Going back to zooming out again, if I click on Smart Art, I've got a lot of different graphics here. Now, these you're going to find very, very useful, I'm sure. Now, again, I can move down, and I've got all sorts of different things I can have here. In my graphics, I can have lists, I can have processes, I can have cycles, hierarchies, relationships, matrix, pyramids, all sorts of ways of presenting information or data. Can anyone think how you might practically, you might use some of this, perhaps in a, in a, in a, in a, in a sort of way, either in the, in the office or in a, in, a, in a study environment or something? I remember the pyramid. Uh, I remember using that in biology, in the case of evolution. Yeah, 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 yeah. Pyramids, yeah, pyramids of biomass and that sort of thing. Yeah, great stuff. And this would be a a, a super way of presenting that. Yes, yeah, that's really good. Um, one of the things that I was thinking of, um, perhaps with some of the, uh, the 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 cycle ones that we've got, and um, if I just zoomed in on some of these. Um, perhaps for the concepts of something like mind mapping or uh, spider diagrams that kids use in school for, for remembering um, uh, and, and learning for, for GCSEs. Maybe they're good ideas for that. Um, I want to look at one of them first of all. Um, for structures that exist perhaps within, uh, well, within all organisations, um, I want to have a little look at, at, at this one that relates to um, hierarchies, so perhaps a, 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 a management structure system. Now if I zoom back out again, um, here straight away it comes up on the right, I can either do one of two things here. I can type my text on the right hand side over here and there's a space for me to write my text in for all of the different structures in a system or I can write my text in the box over here on the left hand side. Well, I want, I want to focus on writing over here. And I, I'm just going to do a, uh, a, a system that perhaps I, I, I was familiar with when I was teaching in schools. And you would have the, the head teacher uh, in, in charge. You might have a, a deputy, perhaps the first deputy. You might have um, a head of department. We might have um, second in department. We might have down here subject leaders, if I call it subject leaders. And then down here, the important ones, we might have the, the teaching staff. There we go. Now, if I zoom out. There's a sort of rough version of an organizational chart. Now, I, I think that's a, a, a nice start with this. But of course, there's lots of things that I can do with this. If I want to, if I, if I decide that I don't like this layout, well, perhaps I can change it and they come across with different styles that I might prefer. Now, as we saw with Live Preview before, again, once I click on the, uh, the area in the middle here, it changes the ribbon at the top, and I can change the layouts on this. I can scroll down here, and I can change the layouts to, to, to really all sorts of different things that I might like. And again, it all comes up as Live Preview. And I think that's going to be of great benefit to the business world and the educational world, where they can change the different layouts to see what might suit them best. Uh, additionally, I can change colors if I want. And again, live preview makes it much, much better and far easier to see. In terms of uh, the different smart learn styles or smart art styles that I can look at, again here, and, and of great, great benefit. I can scroll down and again move across to the different ones to get a live preview of what best suits my needs. Stephen, is there a certain number of uh, letters or words you, have, you can use within the... What happens with this is if, you, if I were to, to uh, e extend this and um, for example if I were to write headmaster in there it makes the font that much smaller okay so it fits in that little box. I can of course extend the boxes as well which is great isn't it? All right. 
So that's that, uh, a, a look at that uh, particular type in terms of um, what we did there for um, setting up organizational charts. 